is a snowy morning, so we're gonna go out skiing. But first, I gotta get some paintings on my website that I just finished up yesterday. We are headed out to go skiing today. It's powder day. Owen's worried because he's too late. We're catching the bus halfway. Usually drive halfway. It's just easier than catching the bus from our house, which is unfortunate because it would be way easier if we caught it right here. But there's not enough buses this year. Should be a good one out there. It snowed four inches last night, but we're hoping for more. I don't know. It is such a calm day out here. It's so nice. Usually it gets really windy here. So the calmness is such a relief. It's oh, just such an amazing ski day. I just love the sun. the four inches that we got just like made it so soft which is great such a cool inversion happening behind me you can even see town so that's the town of jackson you can see snow king over there which is the ski resort next to where i live and then here we're on jackson hole mountain resort and just rode up the thunder lift and are skiing down a run called grand i like this run there's not too many people on it ever and it's usually has more snow than a lot of other ones that get skied over <laughs> I'm feeling kind of sexy, people like me this way No, I don't care for superficial, but I do it for pain Yeah, I'ma spend my time on ground until the beat in our head You wanna know, I'm gonna show ya, yeah One, two, three, come party with me Gotta go all night, don't need no sleep Gotta go real high, cause I'm living the dream is actually in Corbett's cabin behind me where I just had my coffee was right before my wedding. I sat in there with my dad before we walked down the aisle. So now it's a really special place to me. Um, so I love going in there and visiting right before we see the pool. A little bit of sun's popping out. So hopefully it's not too bad. So I'm about halfway down the bowl and it's actually really nice out. The sun came out a little bit. So we got a little bit of light, which always helps because the bowl can be super flat. There's blue sky behind me. Check this out. Oh my gosh. Owen just texted me, said he's at the Mangy Moose, which is one of the bars down at the bottom. So I'm gonna go down to the Moose right now. It'll take like 15 minutes to get down probably, and then we'll go have opera. There are a number of places that you can operate after skiing but we're going to the most popular one. a fun day out there we'll probably come back tomorrow because it was so nice out and we're supposed to get more snow so i'm so excited the sun popped out our fun opera sesh it's been so nice skiing in jackson this year there haven't been a ton of people during covid there was so many people that kind of moved here just for a getaway from the cities and so now that there's like a little less people here year-round it seems like it's so much more of an empty resort which is really nice. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> I'm gonna drive home, have some dinner, gotta pick up a couple of things at the grocery store, and then sleep for another day of skiing tomorrow. I think we're gonna go backcountry. So we will see you then.
It's another snow day today, but before we go out skiing, I'm going to paint some skiers on my newest painting. I've got the base laid down, which is like a textured snow look, and then I'll be putting skiers, a lift, and some trees on top of that. But I've got the snow to inspire me right now outside my window, I will show you. And just so I get a good view, all my stuff is set up right here. But I'll be taking some of the footage that I got out skiing so that I can get some of the skiers on here and get the perspective right of skiers coming down the hill. Before I continue on my bigger painting, I've got a smaller painting that I'm working on, which is a really cool texture. This one's actually for an event in town. It's called a whodunit. I don't know, it might be in other towns as well, but people come and bid on artwork and then they get it and then the proceeds go to the Center for the Arts. So. This one will just be for a fundraiser. It should be very cool and different than a lot of the paintings there, so that's fun. And then after this, we'll go on back to the big one that I was working on before. Here is our finished product. It's so cute. We're just like a little tiny ski portrait on a wall. to the village right now in the afternoon you can drive there for free after one so that's what we waited for and we waited for it to snow more yeah so it snowed five inches overnight five overnight and another six inches since 6 a.m. and it's been snowing all day so there could be up to like 15 inches in the backcountry so we're going out of bounds I usually stay in bounds but I'm gonna go with oh and out of bounds today so I've got my out of bounds outfit on instead of my zebra pants I even brought my fat skis. I also got my regular skis too, but I think I'm gonna bring my fat ones. I've only used them once so far, so I'm just getting used to them. And the only other thing we have to do is look up the Abbey Report. No one has already done it, because I feel like you do it right away. At least eight times a day. <laughs> but the things that we're looking for today are... Wind slabs. There was a little bit of wind, uh, mostly above 9,000 feet. Uh, luckily today, it, well, unluckily, it's cloudy, so we won't be above 9,000. We'll be skiing in the trees anyway. So we're basically looking for small pockets of wind transferred snow, uh, but mostly in the trees. And what we're gonna be skiing is gonna be pretty mellow anyway. So we're just gonna go have some fun and ski some powder. Yes, that is your Abbey Report. If you are ever going out of bounds in Jackson, make sure you have all the equipment that you need have probably taken an Abbey course, have a partner, and even if you're going by yourself, which you shouldn't do, bring the stuff anyway, because it's possible that you could trigger something. You could like Abbey on somebody else and then you need to go find them. So don't be mean and bring nothing. Always be prepared so that you can help out when necessary and just be smart and you're gonna go out there. Quite the cardio workout. Trying to keep up. Oh man, I need to work out a little bit more. Light snow, deep snow. We're gonna make it to the top. We made it. Now we're all sweaty. out there. Haley finally got a good powder day out at Four Pines. I did. He usually takes me out and it ends up being like somehow bad snow even though it's supposed to be good snow. So I haven't believed him yet that it's amazing out there. But it was very deep and pretty amazing out there. So. And now she wants to go to Japan. I, I wanted to go to Japan before that. Hopefully there will be a Japan vlog coming soon. 